Mia is making tea for her mother. But the ingredients that she put in the milk were not in proper order. Due to which the tea turned out to not taste good. There is an order to make or do anything. Come, let us learn about the same in this module. Learning Objectives By the end of this module, a learner will know about What is Process Writing? Rules for Process Writing Examples of Process Writing What is Process Writing? A process is a series of instructions given to describe an activity or action that achieves a result. It is given in a sequential manner. Process writing is a step-by-step -step description of how something is made or happens. Rules for Process Writing the process that will be given to you will be an active voice. The task at hand is to convert this into passive voice. Passive voice is used in process writing since while describing a process, the focus is on describing the action and not on the doer of the action. In active voice, the doer of the action attains maximum attention. Do not give direct instructions or commands while writing a process in passive voice. Do not use the word you. Words such as firstly, next, then, finally, may be used. Try and convert each sentence given in active voice into passive voice. Do not get confused by looking at all the instructions at one go. But after you have read them once, convert each one of them from active to passive voice one at a time. Remember, in active voice, the subject acts upon the verb, while in passive voice, the subject is acted upon by the verb. It is just a matter of changing the word order while keeping the meaning of the sentence intact. Examples of Process Writing How to Make a Pizza Dough Pour one and a half cups of warm water into a large bowl. Sprinkle with yeast and let it stand until foamy for about five minutes. Whisk sugar, oil and salt into the yeast mixture. Add flour and stir until a sticky dough forms. Transfer the dough to an oiled bowl and brush the top with oil. Cover the bowl with plastic wrap and set aside in a warm, draft-free place for about one hour until the dough has doubled in bulk. Turn the dough out onto a lightly floured work surface and gently knead it one or two times before using. Now, 
Let us take each sentence one by one and convert it into passive voice. One and a half cups of water are poured into a large bowl. This is sprinkled with yeast and allowed to stand for about five minutes until it is foamy. Sugar, oil and salt are then whisked into the yeast mixture. Next, flour is added to this mixture until a sticky dough is formed. The dough is then transferred to an oiled bowl and the top is brushed with oil. The bowl is covered with a plastic wrap and set aside for one hour in a draft-free place till it has doubled in bulk. Finally, this dough is turned out onto a lightly floured work surface and gently kneaded one or two times before it is used. Now, let us practice. Look at the instructions given and write the process in about 150 words.